Don't just have the biggest EP. Definitely gonna be a bit of a lower energy stream today. I am yawning like crazy. <sighs> a bit of a retread from last night as well. Since today I'm gonna be grinding out um all 20 ranks of the glitz bits once again. Maybe doing some of the um other fetch quests around the road part. Maybe I'll get to your air kisses in just a moment. Coffee! That's what I need! I need fucking coffee! When you're at. Oh, guess I gotta wait for the game to pop up first. God damn. Here's your ear kisses. There it is. So yeah, last night we completed chapter three. We have not started chapter four. Um we have reset the glitz pits, so we are back down at rank 20. Of course, we're at level 13. We are Bela's star. Got a nice super hammer. Got super boots. Got airplane and a wiggle. Paper mode, technically. I did get a new um, star power. I'm not entirely sure what it is quite yet. Um... Like, at the very end of Chapter 3, we start getting star points again, so we might actually level up this, this, uh, this stream. Of course, as always, we have Goombella, the fucking goat. We got Coops, we got Flurry, and we got Hot Dog! Our Glitzville Hot Dog. Our gear is, you know, Mushroom, and in true manly fashion, we have, like, Ten hot dogs stuffed in our trousers. And our badges. Uh, which it looks like we can add some more. I'm like adding some more. Um. Give me that item hog. I'm a slip for items. I'll check something real quick. Okay, no. Mailbox is empty. Hello there, Mr. Gonzalez. Ready for a fart, are you? Well, alright then. Let me just check here. Your next opponent will be rank 19 in the Glitz Pits, the Goomba Bros. In tension and spattle, I want you to avoid using any flower points. The crowd needs traditional, easy-to-follow fighting right now. No frills. Now get in there and show me something, alright? So yeah, the gimmicks from chapter three stay. I definitely will not be reading all the lines. It is what it is. We're just fucking people up. Blong. We have now Power Lift. Briefly increases your party's attack and defense power. 
before I use that, I'm swapping to Coots. Z, thank you for the 33 months! And yes, I know, I'm up before noon. It's a fucking miracle. Or a tragedy in my eyes. Why the cursor with good panels and press A? Huh? Oh. Oh! This one is not my favorite. That is really not my favorite. Yeah, Falcor. I will be using that in total. I fucked it up. I guess we're doing the, the fight again. We weren't supposed to use any flower power. Whoopsie. Gosh, Falcor. Didn't really get very into it, you know? Try pumping them up. That was overkill as hell. And I might be dumb. That was most unnecessary, absolutely. <laughs> I just wanted to check out the new flower power. Not the new flower power, the new special move. Okay, she said no eating. Uh, no items, I can do that. Let me out, 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 let me out! Right. Not that ability, but that's because I love anything that busts my bit in. True. I just think it takes too long. It's not very interactive, as interactive as the others. Um, we can do this. Bah! Hi, Ayo! Let me out! Let me out! Okay, this time I can use flower power. Fuck you guys! We did it, Mario! Wow! It's almost like they're fucking easy! We coins! And we are ranked 19. 19 out of 20! We still have a match. Uh, KP Koopas. Avoid using any items. That's easy. I'm gonna fucking wreck King K, King K again. Thank you for the hydrate iron. Uh, the Superstar sequel. Oh my god, they give us a new game. That's awesome. Meet my peeps. No, oh, fuck it. I haven't used Hot Dog at all during this, so I want to see what he can do. Alice. Damn. That's five damage just right out the bat. How dare you? Let's do it again. Get him, hot dog. Holy shit, that second style is just like only a couple of frames. That's insane. <laughs> now the floor, now how that floor taste? Wow, hot dog. Come on, man. You're the one with floor seasoning. Did you get the bad that shows stylish windows? I did. I did, yes. Um, Pokey triplets. 
want you to let your vote damage us five times. Wow. Jolene. God damn. Face down, ass up. Honestly, I'm surprised I didn't get this prompt, uh, like, during my first round through. Let me at him, let me at him! Go ahead, touch us! Let's touch the primies, the bookies, the spinies! Oh, my cat's in the drawer again. I did get star already, yes! Yeah, I got power lift! Um, since we can't do shit or else we'll kill them, I'm gonna appeal. And might as well try out mini game. Mini egg. No, no, no. Fuck! Oh no! Oh no, that's right! <laughs> Unless they throw something, they can't even hit Mario. Okay, that's a one. <laughs> Don't worry, you'll see Rock Hawk getting trashed eventually. It's like I will be going through the entirety of this again. That's two. That's three. Four! Rock! Fuck you! Honestly, I I am in love with that system. Where the audience can just like fuck you up or help you up. Help you help you out. Anyway! Fuck you! I think guarding still counts for letting them damage you, but super guarding doesn't. That might be true, but I can take their bit their their attacks head on. I don't give a shit. I always forget to do, um, Oops' stylish attack, style, second stylish after his uh, base attack. Woohoo! We did it, Mario! Wow! Wow! This is also where I will be going. If I ever need to make money. Wow. wow. Thank you, Owen Wilson. Ooh. Ooh. Oh my god. No, I'm not saying that. I'm not saying that. The dead bones. Appeal at least three times. I can do that. Let me fight. Let me fight. Let me fight. Let me at him! Let me at him! Okay, fuck it, I'm saying it. Is Mario in a polyamorous relationship? Because he sleeps with all of his partners. We're gonna bone ya, they're gonna bone you! Appeal at least three times. One! Ow. Ow. Three. I can't believe I have to hold out. No. I have to disbase myself in a bunch of 
a bunch of people I barely know just so I can get some clout. This is where I would look straight into the camera if I was in the office. Oh god, I'm literally doing what Mario's doing. I'm sorry guys, I didn't appeal to you three times during the last bout. I guess my rank's not going up. Ah, uh, yes. Wrestling! Damage you five times again? Ah, uh, that's the slowest one! Yeah, MMI fighters are the first VTubers. That's what I'm gonna say. Honestly, the day I become an MMA fighter is the day I'm committing to the trash man bit and just becoming Danny DeVito. I will bring a trash can and a trash bag and some garbage. Everything. I'll make sure to throw away, like, half of my uneaten lunch to make sure I'm the one that actually ate that lunch. I'm not eating someone else's lunch. Just eating part of my lunch on stage, you know. You know how it is. You want me to suplex someone? I'll suplex you! Ow! 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 Oh, oh, oh. This is a pickle. What I'm gonna try... is this. Oh, boo! Boo! Boo, I say. Amy! That was what, two times? Fuck. That's right, I gotta be bad! Um... Oh, rolled spinies to flip them. I will try that next time around. Fuck, fuck. Oh my god, I fucked that so bad. <laughs> Holy shit. Holy shit. I don't have fire. Uh, I don't have FP. Fuck it. If they won't hurt me, I'll hurt me. Oh my god. Oh my god, it's so tiny! Okay, that is fucking adorable. We're switching. <laughs> okay, I don't need syrup. I have sweet treats. I think this is why I never um, went back to do the glitz pit. Okay, that has to have been enough. That's quite hammer these bitches. No! Okay, that sucks. They're literally just invincible. Yes, I got it! <laughs> Son of a bitch. Um, fuck you. Okay, honestly, the fact that they are like completely invincible when they're like that <laughs> is kind of bullshit. I was not expecting Hot Dog to make the, en the enemy actually fucking fly. <laughs> he got juggled. God damn, Hot Dog, you gotta put stop playing those fighting games. <laughs> Oh my god. 
Hot dog would be a toxic fighting game player. As soon as you go down, as soon as you start losing, he would teabag the fuck out of you. <laughs> hey, his name's not Yoshi, his name's Hot Dog. I did not hit the right one. Yeah, you better be bad. Address him properly. Drown face in the geography. <laughs> Guilty gear. Yeah. Keep that ally of yours from attacking. You the only one we want to see attack? Okay. Hot dog really hit him what the ground based neutral guilty gear is known for. <laughs> Damn. When you mention guilty gear, it makes me want to play skull girls. Let me at him, let me at him! Hot dog, you ain't gonna do shit! He's not even gonna get the, the chance to attack. Can't believe hot dog is a true hoagie. You know, I'm gonna take back the whole uh, Mario being polyamorous because he sleeps with his partners. Papa, literally a fucking child! <laughs> How's the floor taste? It tastes like floor seasoning. Need clarity on an earlier statement. Because it sounded like I said hot dog is a true hokey. <laughs> I did say that. Listen, sometimes I he I've heard hot dogs sometimes be referred to as hoagies, and that's just what my brain <laughs> went to. <laughs> um, avoid using a jump. Got it. Oof. Oof indeed. If I can't jump, then I'm bringing in coops. I actually don't know what a hoagie is. I know it's a type of food. Because it sounds delicious to eat. They get out of a hoagie community on Facebook, I found out. And the fact they dog a dude for putting mayo on his hoagie instead of oil and vinegar. It's kind of a sandwich. Oh no! She doesn't want me to use jumps on a bunch of clefts that have super high defense, and apparently I haven't tackled on! What the fuck is this shit? I can't believe my reputation is tarnished and ruined like this. That's a hyper bob clef! Like clefts and bob clefts, this, one, this is also a rock monster. Max HP is 3, attack is 2, defense is 2. This is a hyper version, can build up... This hyper version can build up its energy, boosting its attack to 8 in the next turn. It has low HP, but its body is rock hard and impervious to fire, making it super tough. It says here that item attacks are pretty effective. Beat it, beat it before it goes hyper. I'm just gonna flip him. My camera, my beloved. True. Absolutely true. Okay, so I know I've been shitting on Koops this entire fucking run, but he is legitimately one of my favorite, uh, favorite companions in any Mario's, in any Mario game. He's got the, he's got the underdog Riz. And honestly, if he dies, he'd make a good soup. Even's got a bull on his back. He would need to find a spoon, though. Come on, squad! Avoid using a hammer. That is A-OK. -okay. Mm 
much time. If he dies, he becomes a dry bones, not soup. Well, then we can just make him a good. We can't. We can still make him a soup. Yeah, fuck you. If Coops dies and comes a dry bones, we can just make bone soup. That's that easy. No matter what form he's in, he is soup. Hi, Eris. I hope your headache's doing better. It is not unfortunate. You know, I can't remember if it said it don't you jump or don't use uh, my hammer, so I'm just gonna... I'm gonna bail myself out. Babe, uh, go do your work. Go get your homework done. Let's go, max damage. But you're not dropping. <laughs> you're not dropping a phone. <laughs> listen, listen. Oops. When he dies, you can just turn him over on his little shell and make a good soup out of him. <laughs> He's got a portable bowl. <laughs> Have a good lurk, Eris. <laughs> Give me bone and soup. All the soup. Iyer, what are you, a fucking dog? I thought you were a sheep. I want you to avoid using your hammer. Got it. Aye, aye, boss. Honestly, babe, um... I don't know if you heard this, but I did say... Uh... Koops was like one of my favorite po um, Mario members of all time. I don't know why I decided to shit on him this entire fucking run. I'm still gonna. I am absolutely still gonna. Oh fuck. Did she say don't use the hammer or... Don't use jump. I wasn't paying attention again. Don't use the hammer, thank god. Oh my god. Oh my god, no. You can't do this to me. Hi, Chilzai. Welcome to the stream and thank you for the follow. Um, is this dolphin? No, this is an official licensed, um... Nintendo GameCube emulator called, um... Findall. There we go. Got fucked up, don't use hammer. Okay. <laughs> I, I, I trusted you! Mini egg! Oh, I didn't get stylish. Get out of here! Hey, yo, nice! I do love me a fellow Mario player. Brain don't work good? Yo, mood. Well, I won't know until the match is actually over, so... One of us might still be wrong. Why is this on the... Yo! Hell yeah! And technically, that is um, an emulator, but it is, it is official software. Well, hardware, actually. No, I am, I am not happy that you aren't working on your essay. Stop paying attention to your homework. Coop suffers compared to other party members at the point in the game. He does. Unless you upgrade him because of my god, his um his third ability that you unlock, the like the first ability you unlock for him, 
is so good defensive wise. Oh, hey, I'm also in the major league again. Hi, Terno. I hope you grab some ice and, like, I hope you're able to cool down. Being overheated sucks. Hello there, Mr. Gonzalez. Are you ready for a fight? The next opponent is the Armored Harriers. We use at least one special move. Okay. Got it. Are these the ones that I have to go down? No, those are the Iron Adinos twins. Gonzalez, much time. His HP kind of sucks compared to characters like Mamori. Yeah. But yeah, like you said, he has a natural two on defense. The highest of any other party member. So he he's surprisingly tanky. Ooh, mini boss and boss theme. Special move. Um uh, Oh, I want to try pow power lift. Oh well, clock out. Me, when I want to go home, I just fucking clock out. Fuck me sideways. I don't know who said that. I don't know why. That was the one thing I decided to read. Oh, they didn't get- oh, that's dumb. Oh, what? What? Did I fuck up the timing? I fucked up the timing, that's what happened. <laughs> I literally forgot to let go of the Arbus. <laughs> anyway, I think it's time for a, a nice grizzle dog. Grizzly dog! Here. <laughs> the great us. A few armor uh, Dino twins. Wait, you haven't told Wick that? Oh my god, I thought like they'd be on that shit. Wow, she doesn't have time to explain everything, so I just- I, I guess I'm just going. Better glitz dogs and get the ability to cook two items. I want to see what happens if I'm able- I want to see if I could just, like, cook a glizzle dog by itself. Oh, yeah, that's fair. School is really rough. But god, I wish I was back in it. Scott's harder than Kike when he went to the pit alone. <laughs> oh my god. The tiny spinies. Fuck. Why is my brain like this? Okay, I... Thankfully. Defeat your opponent in five turns or less. Thank god. You know what? There's a cat in my lap. I can't wiggle now. Inkay is the best theme. Dokupon connect. Yes. I heard. Oh god, I want to get Dokupon Kingdom again. I still haven't played it since like... I want to say 2010? 20 years ago? I'd be so down to doing a Dope Pond Kingdom stream. Boink, 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 boink. 
My man absolutely juggling. It is an amazing game with buds. Place all those thingy tools on a door that literally had a lever to open it right next to it. <laughs> yeah, that sounds like jams. How that tastes, fools. Yay, I'm getting double digits in coins. I still need 360 coins, though, in total. I need 219 coins. I am so far off from my goal. Poker face, pop, pop, poker face. No special moves. I can do that. Pop, 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 poker face, pop, poker face. Ma, 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 ma. Oh, it's these guys. So no special moves. I wonder if I can just use um hot dog. The great glizzle hog. I'm gonna try gulping him. No, okay. Bastards. How dare you hurt my hog! Oh, they just have zero HP. Okay. Come on. Woohoo! Still have not brown out flurry once. Ring gate. See how much faster this is when there's no like cutscenes in between. And there's no story progression. Uh, Shell Shockers. Before you take 20 HP of pain. Okay. Okay. I can do that. That's easy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just let me let me take a nap first. Thank you. These are the blue poopas. Let me at him. Yeah, let me at him. I forgot what I did. Motherfucker has a dizzy dally. Fuck. Not gonna lie, I thought that would actually deal damage. Uh, so we're just gonna clock out. So like, mentally, I'm clocking out. I always found that minigame like super hard when I was a kid. Not no more. Bunk, bunk, bunk. Let's go, stylish. Okay, even if they're on foot, it still flips them over. Nice. After saying clock out wasn't that good yesterday, you seem to be getting good mileage out of it. It's a good pre preventative, um, it's good preventative special, very, uh, um, situational, and doesn't always work. That is the un unfortunate issue, it doesn't always work. Like, against bosses or mini-bosses, so they'll sometimes just, you know, lose a legendary action and shrug it off. 
against like normal enemies, like these guys specifically, the best thing you can do is kill them before they can attack. It's it's great. It's beautiful. I will take back what I said with the clock out. It is good. Situationally. I would place it at a solid B tier. Showstopper though. I can't remember what Showstopper does. The fuzz! Avoid using a hammer. I can do that. What do I want to fight the fuzz with? Ah, I guess I'll stick with goops. No hammer. Is the chance to instantly kill enemies. That's right. So it's back. I uh, do not trust those instant kill um, moves, honestly, in any video game. In any video game where it's a skill that just says it has a chance to instantly kill your foe, I don't trust it. My luck is absolutely fucking horrid. So, uh, I, I just can't. I can't. Not again. <laughs> There we go. What if I did a fight by only using mysteries? Honestly, I want to do that. I want to do that now. I want to fight just by using mysteries. <laughs> Mega ten games. I just swear that's only case. I'm always a piece being back and black. Dragon quest. Okay. That's why I'm guessing DQ means and not Dairy Queen. Because how can you like play Dairy Queen? How do you play Dairy Queen? Uh, absolutely yes, but I'm okay with it. That shit's funny. Um, Magic Koopa Masters want you to at least use one special move. Easy! Easy! This is gonna be easy. You milk the cows until you're the queen of dairy across the world. I'm sorry, but I only milk maidens. That's not gonna be an easy achievement for me if I want to become the Dairy Queen. Get ready to brawl! Earth Tremor! Got a hundred percent Dairy Queen. Listen, I don't want to be a milk maiden, I want to be the one milking the maidens. It, it's it's easy. Earth Tremor is so fucking busted. Absolutely, Earth Tremor is so fucking good. It's a free six damaging AoE with for only like two star points. At the end of the fucking game, I can use it like four times in a row. Every other word that leaves your mouth is cursed. Yeah. That's why my brand. My brand! Alright, who are we fighting next? Uh, Craw Daddy! In this battle, I want you to keep that alley of yours from attacking. Yeah, I can do that. I don't have any star power, so it won't be a one-shot, so I'm un unfortunate. 
Why be a, uh, a milker maid? Anyone give me the maid. Milk. Fire. Sir, no. Sir, no. You can't just out yourself as a bottom like that. <laughs> oh my god. Did you get to tattle, Mr. Swoop? I haven't fought Mr. Swoop yet. Oh, you meant like the, um... The, um... Not area. The... Oh yeah, I guess the area effect. I think I did that first thing during uh, my first run through. Turn out being a bottom is nothing new. I believe it. Appeal. Oh, okay. I, I just thought you'd like to know. Good luck, Koopa. I hope you survive. I still won. That's true. I decided to sack a uh, Koopa life shroom run away, but now I know I don't have a life shroom, so it's okay to sack him at now. I'm just, I'm just surprised because Koopa is was getting fucking kebabbed by that crawdaddy. Man went out of his way to say fuck Koops. Holy shit! Get my Batman flare. In this battle, I want you to not not fight. Do not attack at all. Okay. Oof. Oof. Okay. In that case, I'm gonna have Goombella be out. This one might actually be kind of hard. This is the perfect mystery fight. If only I had enough mysteries. I'm gonna target Flare first. Hiya! Oh, actually, you know what I could do? Oh, fuck me! Oh my god. Oh my god. Power left! I'll take it. There we go, that's all we needed. <laughs> they can't do shit now. Listen, just because I used it does not mean I don't think it's a shit move. It absolutely is a shit move. I will stand by that. Wholeheartedly. Why am I blocking? I don't even need to block. Oh, 
Please hit, please hit, please hit, please hit. Ah! What is the shit move? Um, power lift. Happy. A power lift, you can add up to plus three defense and plus three offense. It only lasts for two turns, though. Well, hot dog's useless. If it was more than two turns, I would probably use it longer, or like use it more often. But that's using three star power for, um... Two turns that you probably won't be able to get back, like, super easily. Also, yeah, the minigame takes so fucking long to actually complete. Yo, we can go further beyond! Max BP, baby! forget what the max BP is. All things stingy with attack and defense buffs for the player outside of badges, yeah. The game offers no defense um, buffs outside of badges. And even then, uh, the only time you can get a defense buff with a badge is if you do a block. Like, uh, where is it? Damage dodge. Decreases damage by one with a guard action command. If you miss it, you're shit out of luck. Yeah, I guess I'll, I guess I'll give Happy Heart P to my partner. Chop country! I want you to avoid using a jump. Easy. Easy. This is the one I forgot to tattle on, actually. The fun thing about this guy, I think he only spawns uh, when your feet are touching the ground. So if you time your jumps perfectly, like for only to be on the ground for only one frame, uh, you can quite literally not have that guy spawn in for a really fucking long time. Bum, bum. Max HP and FP are 200, but you can't have everything maxed out at the same time at level 99. You can actually get to level 99? I thought that was- I, I thought there was like a fucking limit. I thought there was a cap on that shit. Not gonna lie, I thought the cap limit for levels was, um, fucking 30. A red chomp. It's a rabid, red biting, chewing, chomping fool. Max HP is six, attack is five, defense is three. If the attacks are so powerful, we could be in a, new, a world of hurt if we don't beat it fast. Which is why it's really, really lame that its defense is so high. Its HP is pretty low though, so items and special moves might just work. Just look at that color. I think someone painted it after it fell asleep at, at a party. Oh, bum. I'll be honest, Chanel, I don't think the devs expected you to max out the level. Alright. We got one more fight before- well, one more fight after this! Before we fight Rockhawk again. 
20 of all 10. I do remember the next guy being pretty fucking beefy. Really out of my JRP and necessity to max my stats for super bosses. This game doesn't have super bosses. Oh, I guess it has one super boss. Okay, yeah, I'll take it back. This game has one super boss. God, I'm I'm so fucking excited for Super Mario RPG, by the way. I want to be able to play that shit when it comes out. I'm gonna bring out Hot Dog for this one. Hi, Soul. The Koopanator! In this battle, I want you to let your foe damage you five times. A oh, fuck! This guy actually fucking hurts! Will I be getting wonder? I will try to be getting wonder too, yes. <laughs> Not on your own volition. <laughs> Honestly, I'm, just, I'm like I'm excited to play Wonder. It looks like a very fun twist on the classic 2D Mario's that I haven't seen in a while. <coughs> Excuse me. <laughs> God damn. I want to try Gulpin. Gulpin these nuts! Damn, straight up five! This fucker is a DPS machine! I see why um, hot dog's so good. Went to a Nintendo Live event with that mom played the Mario Wonder demo and she really wants the game found out her roots like two days before your birthday. Nice. You already know what's happening? True, but you probably haven't been able to get through like the whole thing. Fuck, dude! to let this guy hit me oh my god oh my god well you hit me once that's twice Uh, I could just sound out flirt to think it's true. Ow, ow. Ow, to believe that turn out you shush no defense bonuses none that is a very good question uh babe i have no fucking idea also i just realized why did i just use quake hammer this guy can be put on his back Oh my god. Oh my god. I hate it here. I hate it here. Mario, go to your glizzy. Go to your glizzy and think about what you've done.
Bum, 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 bum. Let's try this again. There he goes. No! Come on, it just went away! Oh, I'm so mad. I'm so mad. <laughs> I have Fox and Cloud. I hate it here. This is bullshit. This cloud is so dumb. This fog is so fucking dumb. Oh my god! Three misses in a fucking row. Fuck you. Koopanator, more like uh, Koopa this thick. Damn, he's not worth two uh, red chain chomps. Fight money! Alright, next up is the fucking championship where we get to fight Rock Hawk once again. Thank you, thank you for um, censoring that. I appreciate it. From Thousand Year Door, they took the vision obscuring bullshit that makes you miss. Yeah, out of the, uh, fucking everything. Well, all right then. The next one be crown champion of the Glitz Pit, Rock Ha. Pay attention in this battle. I want you to use at least one special move, okay? You need to show me. You need to show my paying customers all the fancy ninja stuff you've been hiding. Now get in there and blow the roof off. All right? Chash, air is cute. Chia does not need it to tell me again. Coming back to take down the Major League's top rank, the Great Gonzalez will finally challenge the champion, Rock Hawk! First to make his entrance, we have the Feral Nuclear Reactor, Rock Hawk! Champ! Kick him! Eee! Well, champ, tell us about your mindset. After all, today's challenger is the Great Gonzalez, the only man to ever wrestle the belt away from you. That's all ancient history. There's only one true champ, and that guy is the Rock Hawk. One of us is walking out of here with the belt, and the other's gonna get rocked. But champ, but champ, Gonzalez showed no signs of rest and climbing back up the ranks. He shattered his own records, one after the other. How does that strike you? Hey, shut your trap, or this Gonzalez won't be the only one feeling the rock. I'm the champ. End of story. I'm a legend, and this legend is about to rock that dude. Big words from the champ, and now the challenger needs no introduction. The former champion returns, the superstar sequel, The Great Gonzalez! 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 Jumpman! Wait, who? Ha ha ha! Whoa, they're going nuts! Title matches are so awesome, this rules! Let's do this! Fuck on, man! E Gonzalez, he's back! You the man! Listen to the crowd. Give it up for the brave challenger, the great Gonzalez. It's been a while since these two met, but who will emerge victorious this time? Battle is ready to begin. Ring that bell. Boong. Okay, Gonzalez. We were here before, so this ain't nothing. I'm all fired up, baby. Ha ha ha. Time for you to meet the new improved Rock Hawk. You, the horror of the world, crass rocking. Damn it, I hate contradicting myself, okay? Shut it! Shut it, chat. Fuck, 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 fuck. Ah, damn. 
helping you with it. I want to see how much um, damage this uh, Joshi can uh, pull out. <laughs> Ooh. Hell yeah. Mm, bitch. What if they made this move motion controlled on the Wii Make? Make it less so? I would. I don't think I'd like that, honestly. Because I think motion control would be harder to hit. <laughs> Get perfect and blocked and be some shit. Oh my god. Oh my god, he didn't actually even hit me. I styled on this man way too hard. <laughs> okay, you know what? I, I take it back. Power lift is okay. No, I don't believe this. I, I Am I actually going to get rocked again? Whoa, who could have seen this coming? You can plan a more ferocious battle. Wild moves, raw power, fists and feathers of fury. What beautiful distraction. This was without a doubt, inarguably, definitely, absolutely, completely, an extreme battle of the very highest caliber. But there could only be one winner, and this time it was the great Gonzalez. Congratulations, Gonzalez. Once again, you're a champion. You did it, Ma. Look at me. Gonzalez! 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 My adoring fans, thank you so much. I was a little worried that you were over the hill, but you made quite a comeback. You're a true champion. Oh yeah, I got the champion's belt. Now, I think I know what you're thinking. You plan to move on, don't you? Well, that's fine, of course. I'll keep you registered in case you ever wish to return. Come back and give the folks a throw up now and then, you know, defend your title. Of course, if you lose, you'll have to drop back down to the Major League. Well then, I'm rather busy, as usual, so you'll have to excuse me. I need to work out a plan to bring Rock Hawk back. That guy really draws a crowd. Have a nice day, Gonzalez. Okay. Is that- is that it? Or... Is that all there is? I wonder if any of the fights change if I, like... Can I go back up here? Now retire as a fire and <laughs> watch them like, go broke in five minutes again. Honestly, yeah, they might just... Um, but fuck it, let's see what another match looks like. Hello there, Mr. Gonzalez, are you a fight, are you? All right, then let me just check here. Next opponent will be ranked one in the Glitz Pits, Rock Ho Oh. Once you have at least one sp Okay, okay. I, I, I guess I'm just fighting the Rock Hawk again and again and again. And now, for our main event, our former champion Rock Hawk and sends the current one to pick Gonzalez. Gonzalez, you dirty dog, you will beg for mercy when I take that belt back. You ready to brawl? Yes. Second verse, Samus first. Fuck. Oh my god. Never punished. Oh, boo! I feel like I barely got anything on that. Mm. 
motherfucking fog! Worst time! Worst time! I hate it here! Rude. Hello, oh, it's bringing this shit back. I I'm not going to walk it. for um grinding on endgame I guess we got the bird ah, hi paper king 64 thank you so much for the follow and welcome to the stream sorry I was I was quite literally opening a, a different page to see if there's any reason for me to like continue this <laughs> holy shit there's so much fog you know what I'll take it Re rematch Zona, thank you so much for the follow and welcome to the stream. Can I come back to Mario being someone in the audience? Yeah. <laughs> Listen, the critics can't say anything bad about me if I kill them first. Okay, yeah, I, I guess that's it. Does the champion belts do anything? Nope. It's just them in my inventory now. Easy as 20 coins. Agreed. Well, if I ever need money, I, I know where to go. Thank you, Cherno, for the hydrate. I want to see if I can, like... No? Okay. And thank you uh, for the posture check. Remember, it's okay to simp, it's not okay to shrimp. Anyway, hot dog, let's get out of this hot dog stand joint. Let's leave this hot dog stand. <laughs> the next couple of chapters is going to be more profitable. I forget, what are nooks? Are those like golden flowers? Oh shit! Oh god! Oh god! I'm being swarmed! Ugh. Get out of here! Get out of here! Get out of here! Respect my personal space! Go away! Get out of here! Assault the fans! <laughs> Honestly? Favorite pastime. I, I knew Mario was toxic. This just proves it. Fans <laughs> pay for that kind of thing. True, there is only fans. Welcome to the Glitz Pits. Let's pay to say that. Well, I told him how I felt, and then he said he liked me too. Oh my god! He gave me the courage to go through with it. Thanks, Gonzalez. Oh my god, that is fucking adorable. They actually got together. Welcome to the Glitz Pits with Go, Mr. Gonzalez. Congratulations, champ. Hey, and just between um, you and me, I got a girlfriend! Congratulations to me, too! Character arts, you'll love to see it! Yeah, the hammer is boning. Uh, it's because I have um, the sound effects uh, G badge, which is just giggle. Hooray for the Great Guns Arts! A valiant comeback, and once more, you reign as champion. If regaining the belt is like a soup, what delicious ingredient are you? Um, the delicious ingredient in my champion belt soup is coops. Whoa, hold on a sec, champ! Slash, slash! Okay, got it. Huh? What's this? 
There, in the background, looks like a guy in a green hat with a mustache. Is that, is that a ghost? Whoa, I am paid enough for the stuff like this. Is Mario getting stalked by Luigi? Was neither than the Unplot series are. Hey, hey, watch it, Ayer. We do not use those words in the stream. Please censor sticker star next time, okay? Hit me and get away from me, freak. I'll pay you how hard. Exactly, Fox. Exactly. The great Gonzalez never loses. I want to be like you. How do I grow a mustache? That way, Greek Gonzalez, my son never doubted you for a second. I believe there's two more? Oh shit! The girl that was hot for the Rock Hawk is gone! <laughs> Thank you for the demonstration, wait. We got a man here, Gonzalez! Our revived champion! How about an exclusive? You'd brave fire and floods for the love of your life. Now that's a story. True, we didn't get to hear Luigi's story in the uh, report last stream. It's, I'm planning on doing some of the um, fetch missions around uh, Roquart. Fuck it. Let's do it. And away we go. Sticky Star is... <laughs> Oh my god. Oh, I, I'll, if you want, I can make Sticker Star stream as a donation goal. I think that is the only way I'll be able to even touch that. Do you know why I have such a painful reaction? Because I bought that game day fucking one. And I never beat it. I never completed it. I, I just think it's that bad. It was not worth it playing it. Happy Lucky Lottery Board! Winning number 5149. Very unlucky day. Got a mushroom. Come again tomorrow. I mean, I'm on it, but watching videos on it feels so god awfully boring. It is. It's so boring to play. It's so boring to watch. Bada! Well, I got my second piece of the marvelous com uh, compass at Plum Belly Village recently. Oh boy, I really got my hands dirty with that one, I tell you what. It was pretty wild, bro. Want to hear about what happened? It's a pretty long story. Hey, sounds good to me. Which part of the story you want to hear, bro? Well, like I said, it's a really long story, but here it goes. Once we made landfall on the, on the Strudel Continent, we made for Plum Belly Village. Once we got there, though, we immediately noticed something was wrong. We learned from the mayor that the town was ruled by a giant snake named Hazah. He said his own daughter was going to be offered up as a sacrifice to this beast, too. So, of course, being the heroic and uh, being heroic, I offered myself to go in her stead. Brave, huh? Now, the custom was for a sacrifice to be dressed as a bride, so I got all dolled up. Hell yeah! I was one hot sacrifice, bro. I look good. I fooled her pose and got in his sauce layer. I love how the day they just run with like, Luigi cross dressing and fucking killing it because my man absolutely kills it. I was kind of rough finding in that gown, but I mean, uh, Chiffon really chafes, bro. I finally found his off. And the snake had a second head on its tail. Talk about scary. I found it real quick, but when I came to, I managed to distract both heads. It reared up, things prepared to attack, and at that moment, I deftly lunged left. His gaping mouth smashed into the other, and he vanished in a cloud of smoke. A shining plate fell down on the spot where his eyes body had been coiled. Yes, another compass piece. I set it, and I pointed east to Circuit Breaker Island. Just as I was about to leave town, the mayor asked me to stay and marry his daughter. I thought about it. She was sort of cute, but we ended up sneaking off the next morning. I mean, I still have to save Princess uh, Claire from the Chestnut King. And when the Marvelous Compass activates this time, I heard someone's voice. It was so beautiful, bro. I'm certain it was Princess Claire's voice. My heart began to race. That's when I realized it. Princess Claire, I think... Oh, I kind of zoned out there. Um, so yeah, we set sail again after ditching town. And somehow we managed to get back here to your airport, and here I am. 
Mario eyes are closed like he doesn't want to hear about his own proper cross-dressing phone. <laughs> I'm sure you know this, but that's our your uh, brother Luigi. Duh! It seems like s seems like he's super deep. He's like he's suspenders deep in his own crazy adventure right now. If you ask him, he'll tell you all about it. But I don't know how much his story is true. Honestly, if I saw my own brother cross dressed in public, um, I'd be a little bit embarrassed because I know he would pull that off way better than I would. I would look like a fucking hobo compared to what he would be dressed up in. My brother can fucking pull off anything. I don't know how he does it, but goddamn. Hi, I guess. I'm Jerry. I'm a bomb mom from Plum Belly Village. Nice meeting you. Our fun man. So do I! Like, so do fucking I! He wears everything so fucking naturally! Goddamn! Sorry I sound so down, but you would be too if you saw Luigi dress as a bride. I'm serious, it scared me. It was honestly scarier than a giant looking snake thing. I feel like I now have a moral duty to stop Luigi from ever dressing as a bride again. I have to protect the world from my fate. That's why I stick closely to this guy. You know what? Fuck you. You do not deserve to be anywhere near my brother. Fuck you. That's Jerry, Luigi's bomb on buddy. He's a little different from most bombs. He's really burning with a righteous fire, and I think he's seen some horrible things. Speaking of which, I wonder if I'll ever be a bride. <laughs> Yumbella, hell yeah. Yeah, Luigi slayed as Princess Peach. 100%. Ish. <sighs> yeah, he's. Clumsy, crush a lot. Let's see what you do with the already perfect ingredient, the Glitzville hot glog. Um, unfortunately, that did not turn out quite right. Here you go, take it on, Stompy. Yeah. Um, what can you do with a mystic egg? Don't mind me, just, you know, cooking up, um, Tony's daughter. A surprise twist as a throwback to the original game. Agreed. Absolutely agreed. Sorry to keep you waiting. I'm not entirely sure you like this, but go on. Take it, Stompy. Hell yeah, fried egg. Nothing like eating children in a video game. Um, can you do anything with, um, Power Punch? Power Punch Girl! Oh. 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 Put the fried egg on the hot dog? Oh, fuck. Oh, I don't have the double thing! Uh, unfortunately that did not turn out quite right. Hey, it happens. Come on, take it, Zompy. Well, I got two mistakes. That's good enough for me. I don't think fried egg plus hot dog makes anything but just damn damn it be good. I agree. 100% agree. Not gonna lie, one of my favorite burgers to make is a um, breakfast burger and it's actually make it fucking delicious. I was attacked by power by one but we're getting one FP per attack. Um, I'm buying others. What do you got? Piercing blow, power over, slash stand, plus all, some fire blue. Not that I want. Wow. What about you? You yeah, sound anything good? Rushi, hammer man, and jump man. I will say that. I am waiting for a specific badge from you. Bono. There's a burger place in your area that has a burger with a fried A on it, but also an entire slab of ham. Oh, that sounds so good! Nothing in there. Well, um, where was I going? Right, I need to head towards that shelled village. Meow. 
I'm just Swiss right in. I already have a like side quest going on. But it requires me to get five courage shells. Yeah, I'm doing some requests from the center. That is exactly what I'm doing. Appreciate. <laughs> well, I guess Nibbles get to eat some ass today. <laughs> Um Rogue Porch requests I'm for some backtracking. Done. <laughs> Nibbles eating good. I care if you're on coops for you tomorrow. I'm looking forward to the day. I don't care. I don't care. Okay. Bum, bum, bum. Ooh, while I'm here, I need uh, one of these. I like her. Now you realize this song is so familiar to you? Never in my life have I wanted to shoot a bomb on more than that fucker right there. Oh, the control screen in Undertale. I need five of you. I need to sell some shit. Okay. One. Two. Three. Four. And five. You know what? The bit's over. The bit's over. I no longer need glizzy dogs in my in my uh in my inventory. The bomb is almost innocent and did nothing wrong. Uh, fucking bet. I actually need to sell two more things. Um. Goodbye, glizzy dog. And goodbye, mushroom. I bet you, if you combine an egg with a mushroom, you can get, like, um, an omelette. Okay, we're good. What the fuck is the hot dog description? Mr. Hoggles? <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! What the fuck? Oh my, just noticing that. Thanks, game. We all love Mr. Hoggles meaty meat. <laughs> oh my god. I bet he's the owner of Mr. Meaty's meat too. How the fuck did that get past me for so fucking long? <laughs> me looking at my oh, when my alert has a vitamin self near the show. <laughs> Holy shit. Thick and juicy Mr. Hoggles. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. I guess the bit is never done. The bit is never done with me. Anywho. No, that was a snap. Oh. Fucking wild. Oh, 
on, sissy. I want you to cook a fire flower. Just make me some quick napalm, okay? Doesn't have to be anything special or fancy. Just give me some napalm. Spicy soup! Okay, I know it's not as good as Coops, but I want you to cook this shell. Make me a turtle soup, damn it. Uh, yeah. Mistakes happen. Don't worry about it. I was about to instinctively type something, then I realized I probably shouldn't say that on Twitch. Um, yeah, that's probably for the best. <laughs> Oi. Oi. Here's Courage Cell. Another Courage Cell. Another Courage Cell. Four Courage Cells and a fifth one. Here's your reward. I do not like it. You're a bitch. First streamer with the first chat. Yeah. I heard Napalm and it's <laughs> so Listen, a current streamer has to very cultivate their chat to be just as cursed as them. If not more so. Oi. Oh. I can just start accepting Garf. He called me Garf and I lost my key and thus cannot get into my house. It should be somewhere in Roport. I just need someone to find it. I'll be waiting for you at the house at the very back end of the east of Roadport. Alright, I think I, I can actually do this one now. Garf! Hi, Garf! You took my trouble. Uh, you? Okay, then please find my key and be quick about it. If someone else finds my key, they'll be able to get into my house, so I'll stand guard. I think I dropped my key when I went to the bad shop, but I'm not so sure. Friendship is all about seeing what level of curse this everyone has and then figuring out how to raise it through the roof. <laughs> Agreed. I love you too, you shit snake. <laughs> Good day to you, sir. Is there a tale you want to hear? Those are these are the tales I can tell you now. The wise Goomba. For a mere five coins, I can share you with the tale of the wise Goomba. Tell me. There was a wise Goomba from Bogley Woods, gifted in knowledge of the world. When beasts rose to take the woods, this knowledge helped the people fight them. And this Goomba, who knew the way that every monster would attack, she began to think of a way to banish all the monsters from the land. If there is another tale you just wish to hear, just ask. The Salwart Koopa! Honey! Hi! Hi, honey! A Koopa who traveled the world alone learned of the darkness covering the land. He went alone wherever the evil dwelt and banished it with a shell and sheer bravado. The monsters grew to fear the scar-riddled scar Koopa who thwarted them at every turn. But the brave Koopa was finally taken in traps set for him by the monsters. But, th but then, Abu who fought with the monsters came and used her magic to free him. The brave Koopa's spirit had melted the heart of the cold blue lass. If there is another tale you wish to hear, just ask. The four heroes, uh... The Boo used her powers and magic to learn more about the evil they faced. We cannot destroy this darkness alone, she decided, her face in a grim mask. We need the toad hero of Petal Meadows and the wise Goomba of Bogley Woods. The Boo's magic drew the four heroes together to send the demon to send the demon from the realm from the world. And so the four heroes finally set out for the Palace of Shadow. You know, I like his tales. I'm mystic. Anytime we're joining the beast, you can play games together. Yeah. The, the moment you hear someone who is as cursed as you, um, is the moment it's all fucking over and the curse just skyrockets. How do the coffee? Coffee do good. Coffee wants some coffee though, and coffee is sick of talking in third person. Um, yeah, I'm doing good. Honestly, another Mario Party night would be fucking amazing. 
I'd be down to do it tonight. I'm so down to do it tonight. Yeah, please make me some coffee. Um, thank you so much for making me coffee. I stopped the trouble, and now I can go in the house. Bro, your house sucks! Hey, we don't have much here, but wank yourself home if you want. That would be more. Uh, Gar, part of the Robo game. Pretty sure he's good to guess. He looks pretty gnarly, but he's actually pretty cool. Don't judge folks, look. Me flavor, I got caramel, vanilla, hazelnut, or peppermint. Peppermint! Yes, please, ma'am. Actually, no, no peppermint. I think that goes better with hot chocolate. Um, let's do hazelnut. Oh, I really just went damn bitch, you look like that you look like this. Yeah, hazelnut coffee looks sounds incredibly good right now. And we got a head pass redeemed from iron. Okay, are you let me see if I can find you. There you are. First one, let's go. Give me head pats. There you go. Meow. Listen, as much as I love hot chalky, I need some goddamn hot coffee. <laughs> Wait, you got some bullshit fancy hot coffee out of hot chocolate? I would not. Mind trying a good hot coffee? Hot, hot, hot coffee latte. I. Words are hard. It's me, Poop Pook, the wandering hide and seek champion. I'm hiding somewhere in Hooktail Castle right now, hiding like you read about. If you find me, I'll give you something good. Think about you. You can do it, really? Oh shit! Guess we're gonna find Poop Pook. Poop Pook. Thank you, honey. Wow. Just got up from bed to start my day and the water from this sink is warm. I hate it. Oh no. <laughs> yeah, do what he said. Break the sink. How dare it be warm. Wahoo. You're probably wondering why I didn't take the shortcut. That's because the shortcut only takes me to um, the village. The castle is literally in the first screen. Fuck her up here. Poop -poop. Oh, wait, is he fucking in the actual tower? Honestly, that is my, that is my hard bet. I'm gonna see if he's in the tower. Okay, if y'all remember, way, way back, when I used, um, oops to get the shell, the badge over there, I think in they intended it to be like something hidden until you had a Yoshi, until you had Hot Dog. I'm just, it, I, I just like grabbing things early. Fuck! You son of a bitch! Having things before you're supposed to is fun, true. All right, this won't do shit for damage. Oh well. I hate it here. 
This is bullshit! Thank god. Why is the fog so pervasive? It's ridiculous! Alright, I remember why I was using a hot dog. It's so hard uh, keeping up with this song. Can I, can I break these? Yep. Unfortunate. Right, I have to actually use coops. Boing. Okay, I got that. Okay, if anyone sees a fucking Koopa just out of place, let me know. Because my god, I can't see shit at times. My perception is sitting at a nice eight. Yo! We got a mystery! Oh wait, no, that's a spite pouch. Boo. I want more mysteries and not more spite. Oh shit, there he is! Yep! Blast! So, you found me. Curses! I felt sure that none would ever find me here. I'm a master, you see. I love sneaking and hiding so much, I just never stop. It was a hobby, but I kept hiding, and soon I was known as the hide-and-seek Koopa. Koopook! I thought it was you. We used to be neighbors back when we were barely shell high. Koops, is that you? Yes, Koops, the same Koops who always had to be it when we played hide-and-seek. But you never found me, not even once. I can't believe you finally did it. Yeah, I remember back then, that one day you hid and no one ever found you. Right, that was the very day I decided to become a hide and seek Koopa. Ever since that day, I've been hid. I've hid and snuck, and snuck and hid my way through life. <laughs> yep, that that was a crazy day. But since you found me this time, I'll give you a reward, like I promised. Yo, a parlor card that lets you play the plane mode game. Found this while I was traveling and hiding around the world. I don't need it. Well, I'm off. Time to go look for a new hiding place. Wish me luck. Character arc! I love to see it. I guess I've got a lot of learning about Heidi if you found the coops. It was nice seeing you again, though. See you later. Yeah. I solved the trouble. Now we can leave! And unfortunately, I am not going to lose, lose money just by running. Fuck you! Had an item or something that warped you back to the last town? I would love that. I would love that. So I'm calling it now. I have to go back to, um... I have to go back to the goddamn uh, tree again at some point. I want to... I'm still not entirely sure how much damage gold does. Ah, oh, the Pony Elder! Son of a bitch! Oh, 
If I'm forced to fight these guys, then I'm gonna do it while being stylish. That reminds me, I need to go back to Melee and get cursed again. God, I wish I knew which pipe she was in. Was it on the... No, it wasn't on the west side of Rogue Port. It was definitely on the east side. I think it was in that first area still. I like how they gave the like down pipe special characteristics. Ha! Damn it, Nibbles. And I can do this. I can do this. Haha, <laughs> fuck you. I am the master mounter. I think it was in here, actually. Melee. Oh, melee. Get back here. They are. Yeah. Give me the special path. Welcome back, guys. I have been cursed! Woo! Curses don't mean shit when they're positive, though. Well, let's go. That's right, that's right, that's right! I have enough! You! Dazzle! Give me that power fucking plus, baby. Yeah. Um. Oh, yeah, I guess I'll get chill out too. Badges. I need six to use it. That's okay, I can get rid of charge P and damage dodge P and uh, happy heart P and uh, uh oh, let's get her soft, soft, stop, stop. I got BP badge. Power up, boost. All right, next request. What do we got? Mayor Croup, Pony Eller, Lala, Pine T Jr., Jolene, me, Merle, Coffee Crispy, and Bubbler, the food I want. Um, Mayor Croup. Guess we're going back to Mayor Croup. Yeah. Well, because uh, with Power Rush, you have to stay in the danger and, like, um, perilous zone. Which is uh, fucking scary, if you think about it. 
Okay, my man. Double pain doubles the damage Mario takes. Oh, fuck. I guess that's just hard mode. <laughs> True. Uh, plus their attack does let you blow up a lot of things. But we have something new. Something called the airplane game. You're doing the one pianta. Mario, that's th that card. You got a member's card. Okay, I'll prepare the mini game you can play with that member's card. How exciting. You now play the plane game. What can I show you? Plane game. Ten piantas. God damn. And piantas. What do you think he has an M on his cap? Because it stands for masochism, obviously. The fun game. In this game, you can turn into a pla uh, paper airplane and complete, compete to see how far you can fly. The farther you fly, the more piantas win. And if you land on one of the moving platforms, you'll get a bonus. If you land on a penalty platform, you'll lose piantas, so be careful when landing. The best way to boost your winnings is to collect lots of piantas while flying. Good luck. Hey, it'll cost 10 piantas. Let's fucking try it. That's a little bit complicated, as long as I can get 10 piantas back from this. Oh. Yeah. I collected uh, no piantas. Okay, pretty much broke even. Let's go. Distance? The number one rank is 371. I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna try it. If I at least get past 300... They get that fucking far. Eesh. Eesh. 375. Fuck. Oh, 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 yo! Let's fucking go! 413! The new record! It's the past run of career rides. I like run in game where you have to fly flat as fuck and the guy just flies over the limit in a cube. Yeah. Wagon Star. They fucking do that on the Wagon Star. I forget. Any horror. The boo is very fucking cute. When are we gonna get a boo in a Money Girl outfit? That's not Boozetta. Turn out. Come on. Oh yeah, they're twins. Iron, come on! Why is my chat horny for the boo? They're just... a circle! Come on! Okay, Iron, I understand that. Turn on... Uh, I understand that too, but wig really? <laughs> oh shit, I can break this. A cute circle tree. Star piece. Let's go. I want their eye. Okay. 
Put something on a bunny suit and see if it comes better. First of all, what about my preference? Is it shocking to you? Honestly, I shouldn't I shouldn't be the one saying things, especially this thing. <laughs> the things I've said about some of the things you've seen. <laughs> That tongue though? Runny! Runny gets it. Well, well, Murphy, you must have got my request. Good, good. Truth be told, I've been a touch lonely here with no one to talk to. I'm not doing a voice for this. Since you're here, why don't you relax with me for a bit? Indulge in old Koopa. Oh, to tell you the truth, I've got a got uh, I've got a few things to say about the kids these days. The tempers are too short for their own good, for one. It makes me want to smack them. Why, I was shopping at the Toadstool, Toadstool Bros discount super shop the other day. I was trying to pay, and my corn purse was stuck closed, and the kid behind me said, Hey, geezer, want to pay so we can get out of here before the sun goes down? Now, I may be a geezer, but the sundown was clearly taking longer than I was. Clearly. Speaking of sundown, reminds me of dating that Mrs. back before she was the, the Mrs. Always had to have her home by sundown. Yes, sir. Paul was an absolute maniac. Yep. I've keep my eyes on the sun and off the face of my missus, gentlemanly, eh? Actually, it was sort of awkward, kind of blinding in a painful sort of way. Just thinking about it makes me feel awkward. <laughs> Is it a memory, Grand? Second of all, did I ever mention Boo was that list of video game crushes when I was younger? Okay, now that, that I can understand. Make a pony is just a bunny in a bunny suit. <laughs> Kills me. But that's not what I was talking about. Now where was I? Hmm. Oh, that's right. Kids these days. They know nothing about patience, I tell you. I want to stand up and yell, hey, you punks, be more patient right now. Freaking which I think I proclaimed my love for the missus in a loud voice. Yep, she was leaving on train and I yelled it from the platform like in a movie. Now er what was that? I was yelling to her? Something about her shell, maybe? Oh, wait, I think I'm straight for my main point again. Or wait, did I? Anyhow, me and the missus were madly in love. Head over shelves, I tell you. No, wait. My point was something about kids today, right? Ah, whatever. Oh, my dear sweet missus, the way you comb my eyebrows. Such tenderness. Huzzah? Oh, sorry, I got distracted there. Anyway, you got my point. Now you had to listen through all that. Wasn't it boring, though? I swear. I'd wager. I'm just happy to get a little FaceTime with you today. Listen, we all had a thing for Vivian, and we still all have things for Vivian, okay? Let's be fucking real. Oops, I've got to set out the tea. Aren't I an old ninny? My apologies. In fact, I haven't even added the hot water yet. Awfully sorry. Really? <laughs> this fucker just gives you a goddamn leaf! Yeah, boy, I can cook up a turtle leaf. You can make an amazing tea. Oh, and if you change your mind, you can come back and listen to me yap anytime. Worst trouble ever. You want her to set me on set you on fire? Same. Same. Anyway, you have some greens that we need to turn into liquid. Honey, where's my where's my coffee? I want to drink the coffee and take a nap. As you can probably tell, back um, needs have so much backtracking. And getting up the news, I want to get some insurance on life shroom. I'm no big hairy, but sometimes before my time would be kind of nice, please come to me at the Great Tree in Boggly Woods. I do not have a life shroom, nor do I want to go out of my way to grab one, so fuck you. I hope you die in the hole, Pony Elder. The Piata Parlor is now having a grand opening event. Whee! Whoever takes this request gets something special from uh, Lala, the cute bunny boo. We're waiting at Roport's west side, so please come quickly, smooch. Damn. 
Okay, you know what? I, I can see why you had a crush on her. I can see why. Bunny boo! How you doing with me? I'm top of the word, baby. I'm Ben Goomba Tastic. Okay. Hi there, Mario. Welcome to Barry. It's my trouble. That is super well. Okay, here's your special thing. I'm telling you, buddy. Hey, what's the matter? You look disappointed. Oh, fine. Whatever. Enjoy the party. Mario! You! Bit of an ass. But also, um... That is quite the gambling fucking tactic to get people to start gambling more. That day Nintendo makes a bunny power up the world is over. Oh my god! Oh no, I just so realized something. I, I just realized something kinda awful. For the remake, um, they might remove the slots in Pianta Parlor. I don't know if this was before or after the change, but at some time, gambling was like automatically turned to rated M, um, rated M shit, like in any video game. If you have gambling, immediate rate, rated M. Or like just an increase in rating. So that might, I get, I, okay. Might be exaggerating a little bit. I don't know if it's rated M or rated T, but that might like just either increase the rating or just remove the uh, slots entirely. Andy Jr. Oh, my dad in the world of hurt down here. Please go get help him. I've been waiting in the entrance of the pit of a hundred trials for nuclear airport. No, no, we're not going down there. It's M, but the ERSRB is oddly specific about it. I need some cleaning done. Motivated workers only. Please meet me in the glitz pits. Jolene, now let's go. How specific. No soup, Mario Bros. Bring it. I'm ready because the fucking Luigi Casino minigames is funny to me. Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> Honestly, that's just fucking wild! Ooh! Give me the good batch. Having a harm slot machine the um, that only uses in-game currency. I'm writing. Loot boxes that fun monthly just scanning. Yeah, yeah, I agree. It's really fucking stupid. Possible to game aggressively? I've never done the Pianta slot machines. It's because um, loot boxes don't have uh, the classic gambling look. That's the only fucking reason why. Watch as Paper Mario Remaster uh, replaces the slot machine with fucking loot boxes. No, I got I, I kind of agree. Men crow crates were a mistake. But damn, did they keep the, the game fucking alive? Recent slot machines have fruit icons was to dissociate them from gambling card games like Poker during Prohibition. They used to use the same symbols as suits. Really? Okay, that is interesting. Let's get back to the- I need to clear out some garbage in the storeroom. I can't get anywhere near it. I have a problem with garbage. I don't want to talk about it. Just put it somewhere I can't see it, alright? Okay, Mr. Lean. Yeah, strange I mean, weapons. I 
am oddly bad at poker. <laughs> They're just trunks! Oh my god. Oh my god. Who's leaving their dirty fucking underwear all over the goddamn sword room? What the fuck, guys? Clean up your shit! Okay, nothing in here. We can make our own poker night at the inventory. We could. Alright, Jolene, here's all of your dirty fucking underwear. You smell terrible! Oh no, you don't have the garbage still on you, do you? You have to take that stuff far away from here. I can't stand it! I know of a Goomba named Gungfri in Rogueport that buys stuff like this. I've already gotten in touch with him, so just get that trash out of here. Why is a Goomba buying used underwear? You know what? I don't want to know. I don't want to know. He's probably going to sell bath water next. Message. Yeah, he buys his underwear. Okay, so I need to find a Goomba somewhere in Roveport who buys trash. Who will buy all of this used underwear I have picked up. Gumfrey also had a request in me. Um, he might have actually. Honestly, I just plan on going around and talking to every Goomba I see. There's so much! Oh my god. There's 20 fucking pairs. Oh, one for each fighter. I bet one of them's mine. Hey, Goomba, you wanna buy some... Hey, man. You want a carp on it? Carp? Carp? You want a cop? You aren't a cop, are you? You wanna buy, you wanna buy some underwear? So fresh. Oh, this is one Goomba way more gross than Avis. I don't know. I don't know, man. I, I learned to stop questioning things a long time ago. Worries, Alice. Oh, I hope you didn't drink too much. Hey, 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 Goomba. You're looking mighty fun, mighty, uh, fresh there. You think you want some, um, some underwear? You got a good surprise. What about you? Want some underwear? This one Goomba wears is the bar food too high for us. What about you? Want some underwear? A Goomba somewhere in Roqueport. Goomfree. It's not in West Side, not in Central. There you are! Still some left? Oh my god. I gotta spam all this. Oh, it's the Hitman! She literally just told a fucking Hitman! To take all of the battle trunks from her. I had one drink, but I overstimulated myself to the point of having a panic attack. Oh, I'm sorry, Alice. 
I hope you feel better soon. I guess we're done here with this on this one. Man, I have never had a job this stinky. Make sure you get um duress pay for this man. God damn. Okay, this This job is annoying as hell. Back to Glitzville. Back for back to another um run out another cutscene. Man, wish we could just use a fire flower. I wish they just had a trash compactor or, you know, a dumpster like any civilized arena, you know, for the bodies, for the bandages, for the fucking medical supplies, for all the steroids they're used. Just toss them in the dumpster. God damn. Grubba wouldn't have caught if he just threw the bodies in a dumpster. I'm working this hot dog to the fucking bone. Maybe see why backtracking is a problem with this game. Yeah. These are. Best thing about these um, requests, they're all optional, honestly. All that for 30 fucking coins. Not worth it. Uh, yeah, a request board in each city would make this much less annoying. But you know, it's 2001. Or 2011. I can't remember when this game was released. No, 2011 was more like the Wii era. Oh, four? Yeah, that makes more sense. Having to show this guy my ticket every fucking time. And I go and I don't get the um like Easy unlock pipe for a fucking while to this place. Boom, boom, boom. Was O six and never O six. Okay. Um. Oh. Auto optional quest is a funny way to say. <laughs> Way of saying 100% completion true. If you want 100% com 100 completion, you're gonna be fucking grinding this game for a goddamn while. My man! You have what I'm looking for. You do not! Boo! Boo, I say. Are you trying to 100% Monster Hunter? Boo Bunny? I already did that quest. We're not saying boo hi to Boo Bunny for a while. Bub of Blur, the food I want. I have a bad craving for a certain food item. Could you fetch it for me? Please meet me in Bubbleberg. <laughs> no. Merdly, I want to make a heartful cake. I forgot the recipe for Mario's sake. I have to keep my shop open, so can you find the recipe I'm hoping? It, hoping? First learned the recipe from OCT to Tok T. Yes, over in Petalburg, you see. Please meet me in the chamber's head beneath the port her yet. Yeah. I will take her request, but I'm not gonna come finish it just yet. Oh toast tea! I hate it here. I hate it here. Honestly, in this universe, Mario, Mario might as well be a fucking god. He cannot die.
Wait, 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 wait. It was Merly, not Mealy. Wish to look for the item you seek. Speak to me across the table. No. So it was Melee. Is her name Melee? Where's the fucking Merlin? Are the Star Spirits closest thing to God Mario universe ever has? No. I believe that would be in um <laughs> That would be in Mario fucking Galaxy! You know, when Rosalina reset the fucking universe? Like a yummy tasty heartfelt cake. Do better work, you must go and ask Toasty all she knows. Fuck you. Yes, I did refresh her curse. Loose right in. Yeah. Mario is one of those games where I don't think the lore is entirely relevant. It does not fucking matter. It never played a big part, and I'm okay with that. I like every Mario game having their own self contained lore. You had a Rosalina in blank for a second? Yeah, that happens to me too. I do like Rosalina, because, you know. Fuck, she's hot. <laughs> Kirby lore, absolutely! That is shit is not contained at all, and it goes fucking wild! <laughs> and you love to see it. normal about space mommy you swear you normal about space mommy I swear. <laughs> space mom. that's just me every day I am not normal about space mommy both Rosalina and Samus hey that shows where the fourth crystal star is can't that Franklin guy read it that'd be cool but first we'd better tell him what princess peaches princess peaches email said right oh yeah The group that uh, kidnapped Princess Peach has been on World Conquest? Or having a thing for tall hot blondes? Yeah. Yeah, apparently I have a time. It's just tall blondes. Uh huh, you got that right. That's why those jerks need that legendary treasure. Hmm, this doesn't bode well. The situation has gotten far more serious than I thought. Let me bring you up to speed. I've been researching just as treasure could be. One book I come across held what I thought was a preposterous theory. The book claimed that the treasure was in actuality a great cataclysm. The very cataclysm that sunk a thousand years that a thousand years ago tank, sank the town underground. So these jerks think the power of that cataclysm will help them rule the world? say for sure but what they do what will do or why but we must consider the possibility not that things have come to this we mustn't let them near the legendary treasure that's all that matters because if they get uh do get it then once again this town no the entire world could be destroyed and out with it prof 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 professor we gotta find that next crystal of stars super quick hmm According to the map, appeals the next crystal stars in Twilight Town. Twilight Town? To tell you the truth, I don't know much about the place, only rumors. I have heard that, as the name implies, it's per 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 perpetually dim and eerie there. 
What is the moment? <laughs> I have like something of a type. There's specifically combinations of things that I like, but also some universal constants. My freckles are a massive plus for me. Check now, Wendy's. I'll be honest, every time I hear someone say they like red hair and freckles, I immediately just say, just tell them Wendy's too. They fucking hate that shit. Aha! There appears to be a pipe in Twilight Town somewhere in Rogueport. I do believe it's somewhere underneath the West Park Town. Yes, definitely. If you get stuck on any reason, just come back and see me again, okay? Ah, the pipe's a no-go. We went in, but we got pushed right back out. What? You can't get through the pipe, you say? How odd. Hmm, I'm afraid I have the foggiest idea of what you should do. Oh, of course- yeah, yeah. If you're ginger, you, you're most likely to have red hair and freckles. Like, freckles out of the fucking, uh, uh wazoo. I don't know. I've heard about a fellow from Twilight Town, Lucien Rockport. If anybody knows how to get the pipe, it'll be him. His name was, um, dang, what was it? Ah oh, yes, the lover of dark places, Darkly. I've seen him loitering here in the part of town in the past. Look for Darkly. Freckles are hella cute. I agree. I'm sorry, you gonna turn a penis into a penis? I fucking love that phrase. I think I'm gonna steal that. To be cool, miss you. The Amarian Coops, I hope you two are doing okay. I have a mitt. With Coops gone, I haven't been doing very well. I get lonely, I go into Coops' house, and I smell black Coop that Coops smell. I guess it's your cologne or whatever, but it makes me so sad. I've gotten to your smell. Coops, oh! And the thing is, your dad, Coopley, his own smell. He has his own smell, and it's weird. I think maybe it's the smell of Hooktail's gut. That's disgusting. Now I gross myself out. Oh, and since he's gonna be my dad too someday, I better get used to that smell! <laughs> God damn, Koopy already thinking of marriage. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, Koops. You can fucking get it. Oh, what am I writing? I'm so embarrassed. But I'm saying this anyway. You love, uh, love Koopy Koo. Drink your dick and small your ass. Get bed loser penis blast. My name's Darkly. Do you guys need something? I want to know how to get through the pipe to uh, Twilight Town. Couldn't be easier. You just got need to have something that has your name written on it. Don't you have anything that has your name written on it? Come on, everyone does. No? Really? Okay, hang on. I'll write it for you. What's your name? Mario, huh? Okay, I'll write it here on the CW overall. Some M-A-R-I-O, right? There! Perfect Mundo. While I'm at it, I'll write your partner's name, too. What's your name? Hot Dog, baby! Hey! Watch what you're drawing, buddy! I don't know what I earned in this sea take twilight down, but I hope it goes well. I'll be rooting for you. Thank you, Darkly! I'm just falling real quick. Let's go! I did fall! To Twilight Town! Oh, wait, no, that's, that's Kingdom Hearts! <laughs> Is it called Twilight Town too? Chapter 4 For Pigs the Bell Tolls 
Happy for for big that bell tolls. Twilight Zone. Yeah, Twilight Zone. Um, we are going to meet a Twilight Queen who we shall marry and cherish forever. Wow, is it Twilight already? Oh wait, I know what's up. This must be Twilight Town. Hey. It's been a long time since anyone's come from outside. You've come from far away? Yeah, those clothes of yours. I'm pretty sure you guys must be adventurers, right? This is a bad time to arrive. Wait, but you're adventurers. Maybe it's the perfect time. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Creepy. What the heck do you mean, a uh, bad time? Oh, gee whiz. I don't know. It's a scary tale to hear and scary to tell, too. Oh, no. The bell rang again. Oh, this is so awful. Who could it be now? Oink, 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 oink. What? 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 Oh, my gosh. What was that? Oh, badness. Now poor Freddy got turned into a pig. Not good. Hey, who are you? I'm the mayor of this poor town. Some call me Do Dower. I'm not exactly the sharpest fellow, but I do believe you're adventurers, right? This isn't the place um, for telling tales, sadly. Come to my house. Oh no, this is not where Mr. Hoggles gets his sausages from! No! <laughs> My traveling friends, welcome to Twilight Town. Well, I'd like to welcome you, but welcoming people is generally a, a good thing and there's nothing but bad here. As you may have guessed, our town has been cursed. Cursed? Yes, cursed. That is the right word, right? Yes, of course it is. You see, beyond this town is a forest, and in the heart is an ancient building, the Creepy Steeple. The dark creature who lives there, its curse ordains that when the steeple bell rings, one of the twilighters living here in the village becomes a pig. My beloved ones become swine, while I too become a curl-tailed oinker. I'm so worried, I can't sleep at night. Forests night and day are pretty similar here. If this keeps up, well, the village will be one giant pig pen, which would be bad. Let me give you some advice. Leave us. Leave before you two. Get pigified. We can't do that, Mr. Mayor. We're hunting for something. Have you ever heard of a crystal star? A star-shaped rock that's all glittery? Um, I don't know what any crystal star thing, but in Creepy Steeple, there's a glittering red stone shaped like a star. For real? That totally must be the crystal star! Uh, you people, you aren't thinking of going to the Creeple Steeple, are you? Brr, unthinkable. That's the Twilight Town Mayor. He doesn't seem to be reliable, though. I guess he's been through a lot, though, so maybe I ought to cut, cut him some slack. My, my family and friends have all been turned into pigs. That's not a good thing. This is the village where we are all born, after all. We can't just leave. Could you imagine that being a twist, though? That would be a fucking twist. My god. Living in the dark place, it's so depressing, you know? I don't really care if I turn into pig or not. That's a local Twilighter. I have no idea if he or she is gloomy or jolly or what. I mean, I guess that's a pretty optimistic thing, an optimistic looking person, but what would I know? Okay, I'm going to... That's Freddy the pig. I mean, Freddy the guy who got turned into a pig. When I think of him having to live like this, I get oinked up. I mean, choked up. This pig also used to be Twilighter. This is all just so totally tragic. This is Twilight Down. It's Twilight here, which I guess makes sense, huh? That big moon gives me the heebie-jeebies. I guess the sky here is always the same. No morning, noon, or night. Won't the petrol dust get a little, like, boring? Ka, ka, ka! Take a chicken. Shake it. 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 Shake 
Shaka! Shaka! Boing! Mr. Horro's being the secret boss of the chapter would have been so fucked up, but so funny, agreed. Why do I feel weird turning into a pig? Do pigs feel stuff? I'm not looking forward to this. That's another Twilighter. I hope we can save him from the piggy fate. Hopefully he won't have a nervous breakdown about being a pig in the intern antenna. Berzoi? That's a Twilighter who got turned into a pig. Do you think that this guy was so gloomy that he's even a gloom pig? That's scary. Alright, Mary's house. You've been here! Boink. That Twilighter who got turned into a pig. This guy. I bet he didn't think he'll ever be forced to sniff out travels, huh? Groink! Huh. That's the guy who runs Twilight Inn. Be sure to rest here when you're down. Just remember, when you wake up in the morning, it'll still gonna be dusk. It's still gonna be dusk. Yes, I'll stay. No, I am never using that end card. I am taking it to the end. Yeah. Best thing about end cards, they respawn. Have a nice twilight. Save. All right, at this point, I need to get something to eat. <laughs> so I am going to end the stream here. Oh, I might be back on later today, who knows? But y'all have a very lovely rest of your day and I'll see y'all later. Um, Again, as I say in almost every uh, stream, if you enjoy me and my content and want to join me and my buddies, join us in the Discord. And I will see y'all later. Bye bye.